What's going on, everyone? Dark Water here, back in Taste Maker. Last we left off, we've got the easy done. We're working on the medium. We need 1,600 coins worth of steak or burgers, and decided I'm going to try and convert this over to a burger place rather than a steak place. So, I think what we're going to do is add a couple dough mixers in here, as well as a couple ovens. One and two. Probably going to need another storage rack as well. Ideally, I think I would want three and three. Actually, let's go with four. Can't afford four. Fair enough. Let's go ahead and get some flour. Start off with nine. Did I adjust this? Yes, okay. Uh, I'm going to adjust this down to flour as well. So once we get flour in here, we'll be able to start doing burgers. And we'll add burgers to the menu, and hopefully make a little bit more money, because the profit margins on burgers is a little bit higher. Once we do the medium goal, I do want to give hard a shot and just kind of load up the menu and see what we can do with that. Uh, depending on what happens with burgers though, we might need to expand the kitchen down into this area and then just move everything upstairs. But for the time being, we'll go with this. Uh, how's our decor looking? Not horrible. Except for right in here. I f it kind of bothers me that the kitchen bleeds over a little bit. But... Uh, We had added a nice picture here. Is that any better? Slightly. These tables are really good, though. Uh, they're also very expensive. They're 300, if I recall. Yeah. So you can add one over here and then really push it. But what we are focusing on is burgers. We got bread in. Let's go ahead and add burgers to the menu. And see what we can do with that. Gonna leave burgers right now at 25. I know we dropped steak uh, 3 coin. So we'll go ahead and we'll start that. I'm gonna need probably a lot more stoves. Wow, where did everybody go? There's a couple people upstairs, but still. All my customers left. There we go, we've got a gentleman here enjoying his burger. So they're putting... Okay, let's, let's calm down on the, the flour here. Not enough ovens to keep in with demand, okay. So, do you want another oven? Not enough mixers. That's... That creates a little bit more of a conundrum. We probably are going to need somebody else in the kitchen. You, my good man. Another James. You are not going to be a James for long. Okay, I am going to shuffle everybody down. Still keeping four. James, you are now serving. And Andy with an eye, you are now in the kitchen as well. So with any luck, that will get more food prepped, because maybe we can have, hopefully somebody will be more focused on getting the bread done for the burgers. Uh, nice and clean, menu can be improved. Be nice if my food arrived earlier. I think we're okay though. What are we looking at? So income is 613. 
this month. What did we do last month? But well, we just added it, so 8.97. So total income dropped a little bit, but we will see. You know what? Go ahead and actually kind of. Move some of this upstairs. Let's see the table. Just to kind of clear out the space so that we can expand our kitchen. We will take this picture. Let's go ahead and just put it right up there. Because I assume the decor up here is not that great either. No. Not enough mixers. Okay. I expand the kitchen to here, say. Okay. Let's go ahead and add another staff door down here. Let's take out this. And actually, let's, let's pause for a second here. Hold on. It's the last day of the month. trying to think about how I'm rearranging this. I'm thinking actually putting because I feel like they collect from the stove top last. So putting that closest to the door might be beneficial. So basically I'm thinking about flipping the entire kitchen. So let's go ahead and give that a shot for a second here. Let's just kind of pull these off to the side. Okay. We're going to move all of these over here so they're all in a row. There we go. We're going to take all of the counters, we're going to move them over here. Gonna move the dishwashers up here so as soon as they walk in they can just throw the dishes into the dishwasher get that started uh, fridges are gonna have to be moved okay I'm gonna throw the fridges over here in the corner for the time being until I decide Fully where I'm moving them to. We'll put the oven starting in the corner. No. No, that'll work, actually. Mm-mm. Keep going back and forth in my head on this. I'm going to do this, and we're going to leave it. 
and see if that works. So I do need another stove and another mixer at least. So let's move the mixers real quick. So I think all the fridges are going to end up over here. It's a nice fit. Um, let's go ahead and move. Because that way they can just grab the flour, go straight to the mixer, walk straight over from the mixer into the oven, and then from the oven up here. So I guess conceivably we can just move the dishwashers here. Just so there's a little bit shorter path. Also allows us another rack for flour as we need it. Um, so I think this might be a little bit better. So let's go with that. And any chance I can get another oven? No. Okay. We do have another mixer. I f almost feel like we aren't getting in the... Well, we're up to... That's actually a good chunk of change, especially being February. So we're still doing a fair bit of steak, which is good to know as well. Uh, fridges are full. Take this back. Down to 18, I guess. I thought the fridges could hold 10 each. Could be very mistaken. Okay, I also was making sure I had enough pans in here for everybody. Uh, doesn't look like anybody's waiting on food, which is good. Uh, I'm curious to see what we have for this month. So last month we were at 55 items total and 1119. This month we're at 50. So about the same. So tell you what we're going to do. Reduce the amount for burger a little bit. Get more people in here. Maybe we'll drop... Mm, I don't know if I want to drop steak. Let's drop burger two. Really get the amount of people we've got in here. I like the layout of the kitchen now. I think it's a little bit more. Still not enough mixers, huh? So we'll get another oven, another mixer. I'm just taking a look to see how the kitchen staff is operating. Just to see if there's a better layout method. Another s oven, and let's get another mixer in here. There we go. You are not happy. Wish I knew more specifics as to why. Uh, menu could be improved. Took hours for my food to arrive. Okay, well, let's take back the amount for meat again. Take it down to 16. All is complaining about a high workload. 
We made less. But then again, we also took back... Well, overall, we sold less, too. Paul, what are you doing? And secondly, do I have another Paul? I've got two Jameses. Oh, Paul is cooking. Unless there's another Paul. No. You're going to be John. Danny. There's another Henry. Jose. Uh, do I have any duplicates there? No. Okay. So at this point, it's kitchen help. Ooh, minus, that's not good. What is our issue? People are fine with the price, menu variety, waiting time is less than desired. I'm very hesitant to add another staff member. How many do I have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, fourteen. 10, 11, 'Cause it'd be nice if I could f follow an individual specifically so I could see where they're walking. All right, Paul, we'll give you Oliver in the kitchen as well. One, two, three, Daniel. You're serving, no longer doing dishwashing. Let's go with three dishwashers for the time being. Paul, I just gave you somebody else. Danny's complaining about it. Danny, what are you up to? You are also cooking. Now, I don't have as many people in the restaurant as I did before eating. Okay, well, let's take a look at priorities again. Max, help out in the kitchen. Andy can help serve and do dishwashing. Andy's going to complain, I know. And plate shortages. I should be able to order more plates. There we go. Menu can be approved, I know. Oh my gosh, Paul. How many people do you need in the kitchen with you? It's 
So last month we did 52 items, 1028. This month we're at 33 and 674. I do not have another Paul. No, I don't. Okay. Andy with a Y. That's because you're doing dishwashing too. Okay. What if we readjust this way? Well, I mean, we're, we're ahead of the game, so maybe let's just go ahead and drop another employee in here. Another John, of course. And you can focus on cleaning. But I do have three people doing dishwashing. Dylan, help out occasionally with dishes, because there are actually quite a few out here on the on the floor here. Um, what did we do for income last month? 1349. So we're actually making progress. Uh, our net last month was 415. That's a good month. Hank, I am assuming, is dealing with dishes as well. Yeah. All right, well, Dylan can do dishes then, and John and Fred can uh, help deal with cleaning the floors, reduce the amount of flour we're getting in, increase the meat, because I've got a feeling that's going to become an issue here. So last month, net of 164, 58 items at 11.48. Not as good as the month prior, but we've got a bunch of issues with clean plates. We've got five in the kitchen, one, two, three, four serving, one, two, three, four. For doing dishwashing to cleaning. Paul is still complaining. How did we run out of meat? I think we're catching up on plates finally. Paul, you're gonna have to deal, my friend. Andy, you're gonna have to deal. Because again, it's just cooking that's. We're really running into it. We just got a bunch of refill of steak. 1428. So I'm wondering if we add more, one more kitchen help, if we'll be able to push food out a little bit faster. But we finally caught up when it comes to the clean plates. Hank is doing plates, okay. John, I understand. Just because we've only got two people cleaning. But it's not actually that bad. What are the toilets looking? Ah, oh, yeah, toilets are a mess. So I 
feel like staffing is an issue. But I also feel like I'm about to have more staff than I have customers. We're going to bring in one more person. Good old Robert to do... Cleaning. And I need to increase the amount of meat we're getting. Oliver. I also think we might need somebody else in the kitchen. So we'll move Henry to cooking, I guess. Hank can start serving, dishwashing, push John into dishwashing. And we will bring one more person on. There's no way. There is no way you need more than six people in the kitchen right now. If so, that's an inefficiently ran kitchen. Uh, let's increase the amount of steak we're getting in. Let's take it up to 28, I guess. But we are actually getting a chunk of change right now. So last month we were at 1416. This month we're at Christmas and we're already at 1297. So we are really starting to push it. Ooh, we're close. We are so very close. We gotta do it. No. We were just short. So maybe we will be able to pull this through in January. Ooh, clean plate shortage. That's not good. I also take it I can't order. Yeah, there. we are maxed on plates. Uh, what does upstairs look like? Not bad. You're cleaning. I need somebody else taking care of plates here. Eh, I don't think it's that bad, actually. There's just... I see five right now. Oh, I was just about to sell that. <laughs> I was going to buy another vacuum for you. Or not. Oh, okay, just run off of the broom for a while. That's fine. There we go. We got three vacuums there. Uh, one thing I do want to do real quick. Just this, and we will put a staff door on it just so staff can go in and access the vacuums. Kind of a little, uh, I don't want that door. We'll go ahead and do that. That way staff can have a little kind of a, a janitorial closet, if you will. Uh, what did we end up with last month? 1548. We are just shy. Uh, James is serving. What does this look like? Wait time is creeping up, which is good. Decor is a little, little on the, the sad side. You guys are kitchen, aren't you? Yep. Uh, 
Michael. I meant to. You know what? If we keep you neutral. Just kind of float around. Help out as needed. We are so very, very close. Last month, we were a coin short. Maybe, just maybe, we can pull this out this month. There is a rat now. You know what? We're going to just go ahead and bring William on. Steve, you are dishwashing. Okay, let's add in. Clean plate shortage. Hopefully, want one more person. Did not mean to put you in the wall there, I'm sorry. Bridges are full. We are making money. All kinds of cash here. Hey, and we got it. Nice. Alright, so now we've got hard. So... I'm looking to potentially expand the menu at this point. But in order to do that, we're going to need more space, so I'll probably expand down here and move you guys up to the second floor and really expand the second floor, but I'm going to go ahead and leave that for next time. Thank you guys for watching. Look forward to seeing you guys again in Tastemaker soon. And as always, I hope you guys have yourselves a delightful day. Bye.